My name is Kevin Paschal. I'm a field application engineer for Comscope. Today we're going to be talking about the Comscope powered fiber cable system and that's a solution that's designed to address the concerns with extended distance power over ethernet and networking applications. The system actually uh, allows you to reduce costs and complexity of the install because of the components of the system. There's three components that make up the powered fiber cable system. I have a 48 volt class two power limited power supply. The second thing is the hybrid fiber copper cable. And then the third thing is the PoE or power extenders. The power extender comes in two options, a one and a two port version. And those versions support up to 60 watts of power delivered from the supply device. There's also a power extender option that's available in 12 and 48 volt. There are also variations of the cable itself. If we go through those variations, the cable comes in different copper gauge sizes. It also comes with single mode and multi-mode fiber. And it also comes with flame safety ratings for outdoor only or indoor outdoor riser, low smoke zero halogen. So this product is made to address networking applications that are challenging, ones that are extended distance. So some of the applications would include, for example, rooftop cameras at uh, airports or security cameras in parking lots or parking garages or across campuses, outdoor Wi-Fi applications, as well as uh, emergency phones and intercom systems and other IP devices. The, the key advantage of this is cost savings and reducing the complexity of the network. When we use this system instead of remote telecommunications enclosures, the, the typical solution today, we get rid of AC power distribution in the outside plant environment because we're delivering low voltage DC power along with our cable. So that saves a lot of money. We can also increase security concerns that are introduced by having telecom spaces outside of the building. We eliminate those telecom spaces, eliminating those security concerns. So if we, if we talk about the simplicity of installation, uh, we're gonna run the fiber cable from the building out to the installation environment. And of course, as I mentioned, the fiber cable has two copper conductors. When we terminate the cable inside of the PoE extender, the cable is simply gonna enter through this weather sealed grommet to provide the weather protection. The copper will actually terminate and lug down onto the terminal strip for the power delivery. And then the fiber will actually be fusion spliced. So there's a fusion splice tray on top with uh, splice protection sleeves. And then those pigtails would connect into the SFP for network connectivity. So that's really the, the simplicity of installation, easy to do. And then once you button it up, there are no addressable components inside here. So you shouldn't have to re-enter the enclosure after it's installed. So for more information about the Comscope powered fiber cable system, you can contact your local Comscope sales rep, go to comscope.com or graybar.com.